20 minutes, 2019. Let's go. Monday Minutes with Emerging Black. This is Danielle Clayton and today we're going to be talking about credit education. Why scoring is important because credit scores, they give lenders a fast objective measurement of your credit risk. Your credit is constantly being monitored and even impact everything from interest rates to your insurance premiums. Yes, it can impact your insurance premiums. Without a strong credit score, you could be denied the ability to rent or purchase, to obtain credit cards, and even be used when considering you for employment. Trust me, I've been there, I know about it. A low credit score could cost you hundreds of thousands of dollars over the course of your lifetime. That's more money that you have to pay out due to having bad credit, but this is why I'm here to help, right? So. I'm gonna tell you how your credit score is calculated. 35% is based on your payment history. So this is why you wanna make sure that you're making your payments on time. 30% is on the amount used. 15% is the length of new credit. 10% is the new credit. And 10% also are the types of credit used. So pay your bills on time. Because your payment history, it makes up approximately 35% of your credit score. A strong record of on-time payments is key. It makes you look great to the lenders, right? One missed payment, it could lower your score significantly. Stay on top of your credit card, loan, and utility deadlines, making at least a minimum payment. Hey, if you can't, set up for auto draft. That's very helpful. Don't close established accounts. A short credit history may have a negative effect on your score, although it can be offset by positive factors such as timely payments and low balances. Still, you want to limit also the amount of new credit you apply for. Why? Because each time you apply for a new loan or a new credit card, your score, it can drop. And you'd be surprised about the number it can drop. This is because it has been statistically proven that those acquiring more credit are bigger lending risks than those who are not. The credit scoring programs, they are designed to distinguish rate shopping from also opening new credit. So if you are shopping for a mortgage or a loan, do it in a short focused amount of time. Extremely important, guys. If you request a copy of your own credit report or if creditors are monitoring your account or looking at your credit reports to make these pre-screen credit offers that we receive in the mail, these inquiries about your credit history and they're not counted as applications for credit. So let's talk about some of the six worst items to appear on your credit report. Almost dozens, millions of Americans experience this right here. Charge-offs, that's the first one. Collections accounts, especially like those medical bills, right? Bankruptcies, foreclosures, that's another one that's really horrible to appear on your credit report. Tax liens, lawsuits and judgment, I've had a judgment that was on my credit report, and you know what? We were able to have that removed, and there was an increase in my credit as well, too. So you may be asking, okay, Danielle, how long does the credit restoration program take? Well, so let me tell you this. Everyone's credit situation is completely different. So how long it takes for you to achieve your expected results depends on the number of derogatory credit items on your report. 
your participation in getting your credit reports to us and the level of credit bureau cooperation. Because as we guys know, well, some of us may not know, credit bureaus, they are competing agencies. They do not work together. So we will do our part, the auditing and creating dispute letters based on your reports, usually within 48 hours from the date we receive them. Most of the wait time after is usually spent waiting for the credit bureaus or creditors to respond. They want to take their precious time. Why? Because they profit off of your bad credit and we're stopping that this year in 2019. So once again, this is Danielle Clayton with the Emerging Black Monday Minutes signing off. Until next time. Hey guys, this is Danielle Clayton here with Emerging Black Studios. I want to thank Bird Dog Realty, Maisha Davis, so much for the sponsored videos. Thank you guys and have a great new year.